we go to see a 17k sensor black magic are you making the camera for the las vegas sphere this is almost like dehancer which means if you have the vinci resolve they have given you an addition plugin that cost 400 pounds also i feel like dehancer have just gone out of business with this move from listen first of all we need to say black magic that is how you do a camera update because what i've just witnessed honestly it is the best and guys we have so much to talk about first of all we need to talk about resolve 19 there's so many great features and the best thing about this i get to have all those new features for absolute free just one download and you get to enjoy resolve and there's so many other new things that we actually need to dive in and learn and improve our work and there's a few things that really really impressed me with the new davinci resolve 19. number one was actually the film look create this is almost like dehancer which means if you have davinci resolve they have given you an addition um almost a plugin that cost 400 pounds and honestly that alone it just made so much value or just added so much value to the davinci resolve and i cannot wait to explore this also i feel like dehancer have just gone out of business with this move from uh, davinci or from black magic and also honestly i just love that black magic keep revolutionizing the industry and we have to benefit everything so black magic again that was an incredible move there's also so many other new feature there is detect first in frame which is something that i've actually wanted to see and now you'll be able to track more than one face so listen i know i'm here to talk about cameras but this is something that needs its own video so resolve 19 i cannot wait to try that and now let's talk about cameras listen black magic just flex on basically everyone you do have 17k 12k and you know the best thing is how they started with the 12k and show you everything that that camera has to offer i was actually expecting a new design or a new body just like the c300 but honestly seeing what this camera has to offer i don't think i can complain because as a filmmaker it's very important to kind of like get value for your money and that is what the 12k gives you have you seen 12k open get well that is what black magic have given you and honestly whether you like black magic or not you cannot ignore the fact that they have given so much flexibility or so much options when it comes to resolution cropping and also frame rates burano sony burano is like 20 something k and that is not even doesn't even come close to the 12k version that black magic have just released the black magic ursa cine i feel like it's going to change the game so much first of all let's talk about the design that camera it's almost similar to the ursa um old generation but you do have so much buttons so much input and output and now you have a very good um viewfinder you can pull focus without needing an external monitor which is very good and i hope that black magic is actually going to add so much functionality so that even the ac can actually access the menu especially when you're using that camera on a shouldering also i do like their media which is it comes with the camera anyway so this is going to benefit so many people and one thing that i did like when it comes to lens flexibility you do have lpl 
you also have PL and you do have locking EF, which is something that it's really, really good in terms of versatility with lens used on the Ursa. And honestly, I really love this version of cameras. That means we also get access to large format camera for the price of, let's say, maybe um, the Komodo X or maybe the old version um, Ursa mini cameras. Guys, comment below and tell me what you did like about these cameras and I know I cannot wait to see what people are going to create with these cameras. Also, just get to experience how great they are and much more. And I know these are going to be more accessible because listen, with um, how affordable these camera are, most people are going to get them because you do have so much value for your money and price to image ratio and resolution and all those other good things. This was a very good pricing from Blackmagic. Also, we go to see a 17K sensor. Like, bruh, Blackmagic is flexing so much in this video and honestly, I don't even know how to say that to you so you understand how great this update i was happy to see it so now i feel like black magic are you making the camera for the las vegas sphere that i don't even know but honestly i cannot wait to see this camera being put to a uh, good use and honestly they also showcase so much more um things that, that have been uh, shot on this camera the new ursa pro i feel like at 14.99 that is an amazing deal if you ask me because you do have a cinematic large format sensor that shoot 12k which is very very good and then on the body you do have almost all the inputs that you would need and you get to shoot you know three by two open gates 16 by 9 17 by 9 and you also get to do two um four one anamorphic or 6.65 anamorphic which is really really good and honestly I feel like when it comes to focus pulling, so many people are going to love this camera because like I say, it saves so much money and the IO, you get basically XLR um, audio input, US USB-C extension, 12G SDI output, USB-C for viewfinder, you get the reference and T time control, you get the, you know, the X pin limo, 10G ethernet, and this camera, they also run with 12 and 24 volts and all for $14.99. Damn, Blackmagic, we really, really appreciate. Obviously, you know, Blackmagic Raw is something that we all love and appreciate to use. And Generation 5 Color Science is something that you can't really miss. And I do love this um, new type of cards that Blackmagic is using. And therefore, just because they are Blackmagic, when you buy the camera, it comes with 8 terabytes, which means you don't have to wait and get the card or maybe get a card from a company that doesn't really focus on speed which is very which is a very good move if you ask me so listen i can't no way to get to test these um cameras and just see what they are all about and also the ability of uh, basically live streaming with these cameras it's very good and they're bypassing the whole um thing that you have to use other accessories to live stream from your camera and you can also use your your mobile network if you have a fast internet which is very very good and honestly you guys are going to love this camera so honestly you can go on black magic website right now and check and basically get to test those 12k or 17k clips and see how those things look and i actually cannot wait to see um the video that so many people are filming with this camera and that's all on this video if you want to watch my reaction to the black magic pixie listen watch the next